Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Project-based businesses that want to track income and expenses for customer projects can use the Jobs feature within QuickBooks to do this. You can create a job for a customer in the Customers and Jobs list. To do this, open the Customer Center window and then select the name of the customer for whom you want to create a job within the Customers and Jobs list. Then click the New Customer and Job button in the upper left corner of the Customer Center window and choose the Add Job command from the drop-down menu to open the new job window. This window is just like the new customer window except that the first three tabs in the new job window will already be filled in with the selected customer's information. All you need to do is enter a name for the job into the job name field at the top of the window and then click the job info tab to enter the specific job information. On this tab you can enter a longer description for the job into the job description field. Then enter the type of job into the Job Type field or choose a previous entry made within this field from the drop-down menu. This field helps you categorize the types of projects you perform for customers. You can use its values as a report filter so you can see income and expense by job type. Select the status of the job from the Job Status drop-down field. Be sure to update the value within this field as the project progresses. When the job starts, enter the start date into the start date field. Then enter the best estimate as to when the job will be completed into the projected end date field. When the project finally finishes, enter its actual end date into the end date field. When finished, click the OK button to add the job to the customers and jobs list. Note that jobs for customers appear as sub-account entries within this list. After you have created a job for a customer, you can record income and expenses for the customer job by using the customer job column that appears within the line items area in your forms, like the Enter Bills form for example. You can also create estimates to give to a customer for a proposed job within QuickBooks. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.